Hi everyone! When the tech is in touch, my name is Vasily and today I'm going to show you how to quickly check product info using barcode scanner and update quantity. Let's do it! First of all, let's open the quick info menu and scan any product, for example, this green tea. Here we see the photo of this product, its name, price, how many we have on hand, its weight, etc. Below we see the locations where it's stored, uh, its lot numbers, product owner, expiration dates, um, quantity reserved, packages where it's stored, etc. We can also scan a location to check how many items should be there. Oh, we see that Odo and Venter thinks that only one kilo here, but in reality we have two kilos. Let's update the quantity on this spot. So, let's check the serial number. It's slot 2, boss X, and we enter quantity 2. That is it. Let's check what we have now in bin 3. So, now we have two kilos of green tea. Besides the basic info about some product, you can find all general information and change it. Let's scan this item. Good. Clicking on the info icon and I see all the information. Its product name, internal reference, barcode. By the way, we can change it or, for example, insert if it missed. Uh, but we'll not do it. Okay. What else? We can change routes, uh, we can see weight and change it and for example let's set volume of, for this product and save all the information. By the way you can even print the product label right here clicking on the print button but it's another story and you can watch it in another video. You can scan not only product barcode, but for example lot or serial number. For example, let's scan the serial number of this MacBook. Yes, I see exactly this item. Uh, let's check in general how many we have MacBooks in our warehouse. I'm scanning the product barcode. And I see that only three units left. Let's replenish it. Okay, I just click in replenish button. Let's replenish for 15 more items. I will set schedule date by the end of the month and uh, choose buy route and replenish. That is it. Now let's check just created purchase order. For that go to the PO menu. Here we see the last order, the schedule date the end of the month. Uh, we see our MacBooks inside, so easy. Now let's check these notepads. By the way, you can search for product manually instead of scanning it if you wish. Hmm, I see in order it's in bin 4, but in reality I see it in bin 5. We can easily move products from one location to another. So clicking transfer, select needed warehouse, Scan the destination location and let's put it in pack and confirm. That is it. Now let's check what we have in this package. Yes, now this pellet 2 is stored in bin 5 and contains one notepad black. This is all for today. Now you know how to check all the info about product, location or package using the quick info menu in the Venter mobile app. By the way, you can call this function, I mean quick info, during all warehouse operations, for example picking. Just click on the three dots and info. And of course, feel free to go to the comment section below and leave your comments. I will answer all of them. See you soon. Bye.